have got the first set of Division Rival Rewards for FIFA 23. Let's open them up and let's see what we can get. Do you want to kick off your FIFA 23 experience with a head start? Oh, go on then. Well, look no further. Head over to MuleFactory.com and get yourself some FIFA 23 coins and use the code NERDFIRE at the checkout for a discount of your order. Link is in the top line of the description. Okay, boys, so today we are here with a brand new video and as you can tell by the title, we have got the very first Division Rival Rewards of FIFA 23. So today we've got my own rewards and hopefully we should have some other people's rewards in here as well. If we don't, then I'll just show you mine and some of the other packs that I've opened up as well. I'm actually pre-recording this the night before and I've left it quite late. That's why I'm also not the loudest right now. So prepare your ears for when we actually get into the packs. But anyways, I don't want to waffle too much. Make sure you guys let me know in the comments below what you managed to get in your packs. Were they good or were they bad? Let me know in the comments below. Anyways, that's enough of me talking. Let's get straight into the packs and then I'll see you guys after. Okay, we have got the very first Division Rival Rewards of FIFA 23. It is 8 a.m. right now. I'm never up at this time. That's why I've got a dressing gown on. Hopefully, you guys like it. And not that it matters. Anyways, Division Rivals. If we go into this now, we have our reward option. So, I finished Division 7, obviously, on the 8-win um, max or whatever you needed. So, the 8-win total thing you needed. So, my options are Mega Pack, Premium Gold Players Pack, 100 Champs Qualification Points, tradable. We then have... Two mega packs and tradable, two premium gold player packs and tradable and 100 points. Or the final reward, we have a mega pack untradable, premium gold player pack untradable, and 12,500 coins with the 100 qualification points as well. Not gonna lie, I don't really care for the 12,500. Um, so I'm gonna go for the packs. We're, we're sending the packs, that's what we wanna see. It's early in FIFA, we wanna see if we can pack some players. So we're gonna go for the two mega packs, two premium gold player packs untradable. Let's select them. Let's claim them and let's get to the store. Let's get them open. Hopefully, we can get someone good. I also have some packs in the store here, apparently. Um, a gold player. Uh, okay, I'll show you if I get anything good out of these other ones. Then I'll show you all the reward packs. Oh, we got a boards and a gold pack. Can it be someone good? Oh, mate. What? You can't, wait, is Kyle Walker 85? I, I keep forgetting what uh, rating Walker is, but it's trippy. It's the boards. I mean, boards are stuff. I'll take fodder because Rashford's out soon. So I'll take any fodder possible. Oh, small prime gold players pack boards. Oh, I think I've already got him a trade. No, wait, he might be tradable. He's actually really good. Arujo is one of my favorite defenders I've used on this game. So I'm glad he's in the video. Just to let you guys know, that he's incredible. All right, get him in your team. All right, now we are on to the rival rewards. We've got premium gold player packs and mega packs. We're going to go with the premium gold first. Uh, let's crack it open. And let's see what we get in the first one. It's going to be at least the boards. We know that. Spaniard. Okay, not really what I wanted to see, but it's fine. Luis Alberto. Okay, 54 pace, never getting used. Well, here's the rest of the pack. Nothing else really usable in there. So let's go on to the next one. All right, premium gold players pack number two. I'm assuming mega packs are better than premium golds, but whether they will be is another question. It's at least the boards. Argentinian, it's going to be Di Maria. It's not messy, sadly. It, you know, at least we can't really get trolled because it's not a walkout. So Di Maria on the front. Anyone good behind him in this pack? Zambo, I mean, he's good in real life. In this game, a little bit iffy. And not really anything else. So there's the premium in gold. So now we're going to go on to our two mega packs and see what we get there. All right, here we go. Mega pack number one from my Division Rival Rewards. Can we get anything good? It's not even a board. It's <laughs> Why did I save the mega packs? Whose idea was that? Mine, actually. But it was a terrible idea because we're getting an 81 Lo Celso as the face player or the face card for this pack. That's terrible. That's not what we want to see. All right, then. Final mega pack for now from our Division Rival Rewards. Imagine we get something good here. Yep, yeah, you only you can only imagine it because it's not gonna happen. It's not even a board. Mate, why did I save the mega packs? Why did it's too early? It's too early for bad packs. Raphael Toloi. Like, never heard of him. I'm sorry, mate. No offense to the guy, but I've never heard of the guy. Okay. Romero though, and Alvarez, who had a massive pace downgrade for whatever reason. But well, they were my division rival awards for the first week. I mean, they're not the most exciting things anyway. It's not like you're gonna get a red player pick like champs, but it is what it is, I guess. I mean, Higuain, dub, I guess. All right, so there were my division rival rewards. Now I'm going to show you some of my good packs from the other day that we opened just from FIFA points and like 100k packs as well. So let me show you them now and enjoy. Oh, that's the first big pack of the day or the, the first boards. Jaden Sancho, come on. 
I'm happy with that. My man, one of my favourite players. I've literally got a thing down there. I don't know if you can say that. Number 25 has Sancho above it, all right? Sancho, first major pack pull of the day. Or not major, but major for me. Oh, my ties to licked. Not bad. Not a bad pull at all. It's got a very good card. Obviously, a lot of good Bayern Munich players this year. That's decent. I'm happy with that. Oh, here we go. Deu Feo in form. Pretty good card, actually. I might have to give him a go. 93 pace, 86 dribbling, 82 shooting, 79 passing. That's a pretty saucy card. I quite like that for the start of the game. Uh, it's a nice card. And more in the same pack. That's a good pack. Boards, come on. Something good. Oh, mate. I keep thinking it could be De Gea, but it can't. It's Unai Simon. Oh, we got a walkout. Oh, it's a cheeky Kaylor Navas. Oh, okay. That's the first walkout in ages, though. Within like 25,000 FIFA points. At least we find it. At least we know we can get them. Anyways, there we go. Finally, another walkout. Walkout. Oh, <laughs> ah, man, why? Why are all my walkouts terrible? Why are they all terrible for Ratty again? Hey, we've got some, I believe, advanced SBC packs here. He's got like 100k packs, 50k packs, and some other ones. Let's see what he gets. Hopefully, it's something good. Shout out to my boy, Robbie. Let's see if he gets something decent. He's got Messi already, so, you know, the luck's on his side. First pack, Jimenez. I'm just going to show you the good pulls. Like, you know, some if there's a decent boards or obviously walkouts, I'll show you. All right, we've got the creme de la creme down to 50Ks and 100Ks. We're going to watch both of these. Let's see if they're any good. 50Ks, not got a walkout. It's got Carvajal, though. Okay, it could still have some usable players behind it, which is good. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Godfrey, 82 at least. All right, 100K now. Come on, then. Let's see what he gets. Please, something decent. A walkout. I mean, like I said, mine weren't great, but hopefully Robbie's can be... Oh, it's not even a walk out, is it? Jesus, man. Jesus, man. What is that about? Oh, my days, man. Anyone good behind him? Jesus in there. Kamavinga's good. I like Kamavinga. I think he's good. Uh, but... Damn, these 100k packs are disappointing. Oh, here we go. Luis Diaz. That's more like it. That's a better pull. Thank God. In my 7.5 case. I think he goes for a little bit, at least. So, probably also good. And maybe use one. I might have to give him a go. A walkout. Spanish centre back. Laporte. Oh, it's just a bit too slow. Is it? I'm just getting no usable walkout. I want someone that I can actually use. He might be alright, but it, at least it's another walkout. Mason Mayer. Mason Mayer. First time I packed him. I don't know if he's good on this game. The only thing is three star skills. Another walkout. I skipped it because it's Thiago Silva for about the fifth time. I think his price range might finally be updated, though. So we might be able to get some coins of him. E1 to 83 player pick. Go on, Mendy. Follow Mendy. Or something like that. Imagine. No, we get Raul Jimenez. <laughs> I've completed marquee matchups for like the first time in ages. So we're going to open the packs up. Let's see what we can get. I'm only going to show you the packs if we get a board or above as well. So, you know, I don't want to be showing you non-boards. Right, hopefully the servers don't go down and we can open this pack. Mixed race players pack. I don't even know why I'm saying this, actually. Uh, hopefully it's good. I, I, like I said, why am I not just showing you the... I'm going to show you boards or a higher, basically. The boards. Quadrado? No, it's Blumin Zapata. There we go, then that is going to wrap up the first video on Division Rival Rewards for FIFA 23. Like I said earlier, make sure you guys let me know in the comments below what you managed to get in your packs as well. But yeah, guys, anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye. <laughs>